made. Um, she hits the ball very, very well. She has the right, the right game for the Wimbledon grass, there's no doubt about that. But um, she still, I think, and her coach Alan Jones would agree, I feel sure, that she needs to move, work on her movement still a little bit more. Her recovery time, I think, is still a little tiny bit slow. And also, I feel too, she needs to be able to uh, swivel faster on the turn. But of course, she is five foot eleven and a half, and it's sometimes difficult to, to maneuver around when you're that size. But, uh, she is very agile, she gets down to the low balls quite well. But I still think that um, she needs to work a little bit more on her movement. So let's look at her opponent, 22-year-old Eva Pfaff of West Germany, born in Königstein and lives there, five foot nine. To One Dury, minute, thank you. a little taller, five foot eleven and a half. Ladies and gentlemen, but a good, Ms. strong Eva girl with a powerful game. Has elected to receive. Often the players will do that. They'll tell you that the greatest chance of breaking the serve is usually right at the beginning before a player has got really loose and involved. And it's often true that a, a service break occurs in the first game. But she's played very well here, beating Brenda Remelton, who came in, the Australian, came in to replace another Australian, Yvonne Corley, who had to withdraw with injury, 7-5-6-2. And then a splendid win against Zena Garrison, 3-6, 7-6-6-4, when she was down a set, 4-5, and love 40. Set, Miss Joe Dury to serve. Three match points which she saved. Play. And Joe Dury will begin the match. Love 15. Fifteen all. Fifteen. And the umpire here, Judy Popkin of the United States. Forty, fifteen. Game, Miss Dory. First game. And this is going to be quite a test for Joe Dury, uh, it seems to be, Anne Jones. This girl. Eva Pfaff, who I remember so well coming up through the junior ranks a couple of years ago. She's a very determined competitor. I think, uh, John, that she's extremely powerful. And I uh, noticed in that last game, she's already stepping in to take the return of serve as early as possible. I've watched Eva's development over the last two or three years, too, on the European circuit. And um, she really is extremely talented. She feels the ball on the racket very well. She's very, very strong and can hit every shot in the book. She's a renowned doubles player and has uh, formed a partnership with Claudia Coda. In fact, there are four German girls who rise at the top of the ranking list now. Sylvia Hanneke, Claudia Coda, Eva, and Bettina Bungie, who uh, hasn't done as well at Wimbledon this year, but reached Time. the semi-final last year. So they really are a very strong team. Miss Ava Pfaff to serve. Fifteen. Five. 
Love, 30. Fifteen thirty. Fifteen forty. Decided to stay back on a couple of her serves here. I think uh, really she'd do well to be following them in. Net. First service. A little bit of tension from both girls, and uh, that's no bad thing. They need to be keyed up to get the adrenaline playing. Miss Dury. Well, she's very conscious of having to bend her knees to those low back end passes. Something she needs to work on. The idea was good, of course, the taking the second serve and approaching the net behind the return, if the serve is going to stay back like that, which is something she must stop doing. Advantage, Miss Dury. Advantage, Miss Dury. Deuce. Well, she's a great trier, Joe Dury, and all those wide ball, something which Alan Jones has been drilling into her. Advantage, 
advantage, Miss Pfaff. Game to Miss Falk. <laughs> One game all, first set. So chances both ways and a game of four deuces. Out. Fifteen love. Fifteen all. Fifteen thirty. Fifteen forty. Needing to speed up that movement to these volleys, like uh, we heard from Ann Jones. Two games to one, Miss Park leads in the first set. And Eva Fath played a very, very good game there. She's a very uncompromising player. She goes for winners all the time. She steps in, takes the ball early, and has plenty of ideas and plenty of versatility in her game. She's extremely powerful and really can thump away those volleys. I think her mind is a little bit undisciplined from time to time. She's just as likely to miss the easy volleys as she is to get the difficult ones. Time. So Joe Jury now with plenty to think about. And lost that second service game to 15. And her opponent playing very solidly off the ground. Fifteen long. Reached the second round here last year. Lost to Patricia Medrado of Brazil that time in two sets. Out. 30, love.
Well, the love volley from her was absolutely brilliant. 40-15. Such a difficult shot to retain control of. Leads. And that really was a marvellous point. The lob volley there, which was what stranded Joe Dury. A very powerful girl, this indeed. Not afraid to open her shoulders, as we saw on that ace a couple of points later when she won her serve to 15. 1 3. Fifteen all. And the first double fault. Fifteen. <laughs> Game to Miss Dury. Miss Faf leads three games to two in the first set. A convincing service game like that will do wonders for her nerves, won't it? Yes, I was just thinking that, John, that uh, in that game she was moving very, very much more quickly, Joe. And uh, it's often the nerves that uh, tend to make your feet stick to the ground. And there was one particular point at 15-all uh, where she had to think mentally very quickly too. There's Eva well inside the baseline, you'll notice, to return serve and fades that backhand away. But Joe reaches to her right and the ball just lands inside the line. Really was a great get. And she's going to have to play a lot more of those sort of shots if she's going to win this match. Eva Faf has a, an interesting Time. grip on her racket because she has a slight thumb deformity on her right hand and she has to file down the grip of the racket so that she can lodge the thumb in the grip and this makes her forehand a little bit awkward for her. She's certainly extremely powerful on the backhand side. And she has a break then, 3-2, first set. Out. Love, 15. And with young Claudia Coda of Germany, one of the best youngsters in Europe, the Germans have a tremendous team these days. taking lots of time. Love, 40. Moved in behind a very short serve.
game to Miss Dory. Three games all. In the first set, and as Joe Dury starts to relax, so apparently her opponent starts to tighten up a little. It was her first double fault. Fifteen. Nevertheless, the volleying attempts that she's made are beginning to pay dividends and she must keep going in and not be discouraged by having lost a couple of points like that. Well served. Four games to three, Miss Dory leads, first set. To start with, she allowed uh, Faf to play from the back of the court and engage her in a few rallies, but now it's a different story. Well, now she's moving her feet better, John, and moving towards the net. It really is quite a different uh, kettle of fish. She needs to think mentally very quickly. She needs to move very, very fast because the balls coming at her are very awkward ones indeed. She has to get down to the low ones, and here is the half volley lob, which didn't work and left the wide open space for Joe. Well, of course, uh, last year here, and she had that very dramatic match with Virginia Wade, held four match points and lost in the first round. Yes, I remember one of the match points, John. She had the Virginia totally isolated and put the ball back to Virginia instead of into the open court. So I think that memory might stay with her just a little bit. But once she works her way into this match, as she has now, she'll be concentrating just on winning today. Three, four. watch the way she returns surf here because she tries to move forward to get the body weight into the shot and make make it a firm shot
30. Much better serve. It was faster, deep, and slicing with a tiny bit of slice on it into the body. Advantage, Miss Falk. Game, Miss Falk. Well, intelligently, she switched her attack to the forehand side. Four games all. Which is the wobbly wing of Joe Dury. The sort of backhand return she hit just now, that glorious winner down the line, is going to reinforce Eva in that resolve. Love 15. Of 30. Well, she must keep coming in. Not like that, stay back and allow her opponent to dominate from the net. 15 30. Second service. Well, they were two excellent points to win after what had gone before because she kept coming in. Well played. Game to Miss Dury. Five games to four. Miss Dury leads in the first set. And here's, uh, as John says, Joe Dury powering into the net behind her serve. And this is making all the difference because Eva Pfaff doesn't have a lot of defense herself. She doesn't like to uh, weave her way around people. Eva Pfaff likes to thump the ball hard and win the points. In fact, there are very few rallies in this match at all. Both girls are endeavoring to do the same thing. Well, Joe Dury has got her nose in front again. 
She was 4-3 ahead, having at one time been 1-3. Fought at 4 all. And she did it by persisting with that volleying attack. Now she could do with some really solid returns. <laughs> yes, well, I think we all know how she feels. But it is the forehand side which she's got to do most of the work on. She was running well this time out wide. She had to cover a lot of ground, and that might have been a winner against a less agile opponent, but Eva couldn't really control the ball well enough. An easy kill. Perfect length volley. 40, 30. marks to Ava Pfaff there. The volley and then that serve. Perfect for length. Good judgment. 40, love. It becomes instinctive when you see the racket leave an opponent, uh, the ball rather, leave an opponent's racket. Game to Miss Dury. Six games to five. Miss Dury leads. First set. Well, I thought Ava Pfaff, when she had to serve to save the set just now, played a remarkably good game, despite the fact that she was down. And uh, you were telling us that she is a slightly volatile player. I wonder if she'll be able to do it again. 
Well, she's got a slightly undisciplined mind, I think. She has so much talent. She can do almost anything with the ball that sometimes it's a little difficult for her to quite decide what indeed she is going to do. But at 30 all in that service game, she really produced a fine volley right on the line that Joe Dury could do nothing about. And Joe, I feel, needs to try and return these balls straight down the line and make her opponent stretch and then see, Time. I think in this game, see if she can move into the net herself and take that position away from her opponent. She's been producing some good returns on the backhand, Joe. And the odd one on the forehand, but the errors when they come, come from the forehand wing, particularly when she tries to chip the return, as opposed to hitting it a little more flat. So a break here would be very nice for the British player. Fifteen. She must have taken her eye off the ball. It hopped a little, but and was a good deep serve, incidentally, but uh, lost concentration. She was staying back and losing out most of the time in the start of this match. Served. Game start. Six games all. The tie break. Miss Dury will serve first. Well, very good serving by her opponent there. Just when it mattered, as she'd done in her previous service game. Tie break. Well, that's just the one break against the serve. First point of the tie break.
two, Miss Fox. Well, annoyed with herself, perhaps, but it was a brilliant cross-court forehand from her opponent. Who, as Anne Jones has told you, has all the talent to do any sort of shot she requires at that occasion. Whipping up a heavy topspin from a very low ball. Still the one point advantage, 4 2. One point against the serve, that is. Beautiful down the line backhand return of serve brings Eva Pfaff to four set, uh, yes, four set points. set she played or what a marvelous tie break she played Ava Pfaff to win that opening set in 41 minutes she seemed to know instinctively just how to apply the pressure when it mattered yes John I think that the first point was the vital one she broke Joe's serve right on that first point and then served two very very good serves to get away to a three love start and really in the tiebreaker it's a question of uh, belief in yourself I think if you can get away to a start you have a little bit to play with and then with those excellent shots that she has she didn't make any further mistakes of course she has a lot of international experience too she played in the German Federation Cup team last year in California, didn't she, in the doubles, was it? Yes, she just played in the doubles there. I think at one time she suffered from uh, an inferiority complex with the other German players being stronger than she was. But um, she time. De decided, I think, to get a lot fitter, to do a lot of training, because she was very much heavier. And uh, she needed to do all that work to build herself up and build her self-confidence up. It's a question of belief in yourself, this game. All Second very mental set, when Ms. everything Bob is easy. Serving. Fifteen. Thirty. 
30, 40. That's the way to meet those serves to step in and block them back early so that the server doesn't have time to get into the volleying position. And again. Game to Miss Dury. First game, second set. Well, Joe Dury there did seem to me to be very much more determined. The secret of returning the serve on grass is to meet the ball out in front of you. Of course, it does come off the ground so fast, you have to see it early. And there isn't time for much of a swing, you have to block it back. And she did that so well in that last game. Yes, of course, John, because the faster you serve, the faster Eva serves, the faster the ball comes back. And if she's time. a little bit slow getting into the net, she gets caught. Miss Dury now serving. Joe Dury, having just broken that faff serve, getting off to the start she wants in this second set, but it's going to take a great deal of character to come out of this match now against an opponent who's really become quite confident. Love 15. The serve was pitifully short. Love forty. Instinct. Fifteen forty. But really, she must try and get her greater length on the serve. No play. Stuck for the task. Still not quite deep enough these serves yet. And no doubt about the popularity of that held serve from Love 40. Game to Miss Dury. Two games to one. Two games to Love. Miss Dury leads. So Alan Jones, Joe Dury's coach, will be a little relieved, no doubt.
Williams. Love 15. At that precise moment, having come back from Love 40 and held, that broken point against the serve is worth two points. Fifteen. This is a very big point now for the German girl. Yet again, the error coming from the forehand wing. Advantage, Miss Pop. Good serve. Game, Miss Pop. Held her nerve very well, the German girl. Miss Dory leads. Two games to one in the second set. Miss Park leads by one set to love. Well, Anne, that was a pity, really, from the British point of view, but I think one had to also say that, the, that Eva Pfaff recovered awfully well. Joe, with a slight chance, but... Never did this girl give Joe Dury a chance on those break points. I think, John, that uh, Eva Pfaff in that last game showed a great deal of determination. That I haven't seen from her too many times before. Frequently, when she gets in a down Time. position, the whole match seems to slip away quite quickly from her. But she was determined that game was not going to slip away because at Love 3, she was really looking at a, having to play a third set. Incidentally, that's the first set. Joe Dury's lost this Wimbledon. Ivana Brashakova, 6 4 6 2 in the first round. Tina Mokizuki, 6 4 6 love in the second.
15, long. New balls flying quicker through the air. Well, when you've got a serving volleyer like this coming in all the time, a very good return of service, the ones that now she's playing, taking the pace off the ball and keeping the ball below net level so that the server has to make all the play on the volley. Missed that line by much. It was a winner all the way had it been in. Joe committed thoroughly to the cross court move. Advantage, Miss Dury. serve again how important depth is right in the corner game to miss dury three games to one miss dury leads in the second set well she's living dangerously the british girl love 40 down in her previous service game 15 40 in that one but plenty of resolve when it mattered one three athletic girl isn't she enjoys all sorts of other sports skiing squash soccer volleyball basketball 30 15 Oh, that's a brilliant forehand. But full stretch. 40, 15. You have to be very strong physically to be able to play that shot. Well played. That's how to take the net position away from the server. 40, 30. Dory 
Murray leads three games to two in the second set. Miss Park leads by one set to love. Well, Joe Dury uh, has had an adventurous couple of service games, Anne, but uh, my goodness, she's sticking to the task. I don't think I've ever seen uh, her in a more determined mood than today. No, and, and for me, John, the match has really picked up in tempo over these last two or three games. Both girls hitting the ball harder and harder, and both of them seemingly thriving on it. And this is the first point of the last game. You see the width that Eva Pfaff gets on that service, and she's so surprised that it returns. And she's surprised again that Joe Dury gets to that one and misses the volley. It really looks harder to miss than it does Time. to hit into the court. But these things happen in the tension of the moment. And as I said earlier, she does have a tendency to miss the easier shots as opposed to the more difficult ones. I think she finds the difficult ones much more of a challenge. But Joe is really rising to the challenge, having lost the first set. She's digging her heels in well. With a break in hand, 3-2.